rest of the entertainment world. The Hollywood Palace! Vietnam huddled around their radios, a feminine voice from home is a most welcome sound. And this is the voice that all of them love to hear. Hi, love. I hope this is a swinging day for all of you, and especially for all you fellas of the Big Red One. That's the voice of the lovely young screen actress whose daily broadcasts of news and music from America has made her the favorite pinup girl of our boys at the battlefront. She recently returned from Vietnam. So let's welcome her home, Miss Chris Noel. Chris, it's easy to see why you've become the pinup girl of our boys in Vietnam. Well, thank you, Van. <laughs> I must say you look very lovely in your mini skirt. Oh, how nice. This is the kind of outfit I wore when I was in Vietnam. It was my fatigue. <laughs> mm, I can see why. <laughs> I get tired just looking at them. <laughs> uh, Chris, I'd like to be serious for a minute. Because I know how much your broadcasts mean to the boys over there, tell us about your experiences and what you saw in Vietnam, would you? Yes, yeah, sure. Well, then, I went to uh, Vietnam by myself. I was sent by Armed Forces Radio, which is part of the Department of Defense, and I took with me a tape recorder and uh, a little portable record player that I had, and when I visited the forward outpost, I would play, you know, the top music for the fellas and, and dance for them and with them and just talk to them about home. And I visited um, as many hospitals as I could. In fact, every place I went, I visited them. And um, I took my tape recorder and taped messages from the fellas for their families, their wives and girlfriends, which are just about ready to be sent out now. And on Christmas Day, that was a big day for me. <laughs> I was running all over in a helicopter. I started out in Da Nang, where I met uh, Martha Ray, and she's just so great. Oh, great. And then Saigon. And this picture was taken in Coochie, and that young fellow was kind enough to wipe the mud off my boots before I, yes, <laughs> before I joined um, Bob Hope that afternoon. Oh. And um, when I was in the hospital, I, you know, I tried to think of different things to do. So when I was signing casts and things, I would um, write things like, uh, glad to be a member of the cast, and anything that I could think of that would be amusing and mm. to help brighten up their day. Chris, I know everyone's extremely grateful for the great job you're doing. Congratulations, and please keep up the great work. I love every God minute. Bless. Thank you. Thank you. Chris Noel. 